Hi and welcome again to Tech It Out. Today we have something of a bit of a serious subject. Lately I've bought a few items that have come with one of these. It's a European two-pin plug. Now in the UK of course we use a three-pin outlet with live, neutral and earth as you see here. So this is an adapter to actually fit a European plug into a UK outlet. Very straightforward, just plug it in and away you go. What I've received with my European plug is an adapter, but it's very different to the one that you see here. It's one of these, and many of you may have actually received one of these yourselves with anything you've bought from overseas, or even indeed from in this country. I bought a couple of items from in this country which came with this particular adapter. As you can see, it's not fused like this one, and it's quite a bit smaller. And it is extremely dangerous, as I'll demonstrate now. You can plug the plug into it as you would into the one I've just shown you. But also, you can plug the live straight into the earth. Which would, hopefully, if you've got a model in home, trip out all your electrics. Otherwise, you could just blow up in your hand. And similarly, you can plug the neutral into the earth or plug the pins in either side, and then you end up with this, which is a live pin. The worst part of this, though, is that you can put any metal object into any of the outlets, live, neutral, or earth. If you were to put something into the live, you would risk serious injury or possible death. It's that bad. This is so, so dangerous. The holes are big enough for a very small child to possibly even get a, a small finger in there. So we're going to open it up now and see what's inside, see if there's a fuse inside it. So the screws out and just... And inside it is even more astoundingly dangerous than I thought it would be. All you have are three screws holding the pins in, pressing against the three bits of metal that the plug makes contact with. That is astonishing. I've never seen anything quite like that. Take this completely apart. I'm going to destroy it because it is so dangerous. I wouldn't want anybody to pick it up and try to use it. I'll even remove the pins. I wouldn't want anybody plugging this into any socket and using it for anything. So that's completely taken apart now and I'll be going in the bin. But this wasn't the only one that I received. Now as you can see, if I try to do anything that I did with the other one, with this one, the UK adapter, you can't do it. You've got to have the two pins going into the two holes to open up the flaps that allow the pins to make contact. Very safe, very secure. This is the other adapter that I received. It looks a little bit better. It's got three pins on it. it seems to have a fuse in it. It's got some very official looking wording on it. England, Stecker, Commonwealth adapter. So is it... A safer version, perhaps, 13 amp, fused, it says, Commonwealth and an art number, no CE mark, no BS safety kite on it either. Now, you can't get the plug-in as you did with the other one. You can't put a single pin into each socket, and you have to put it all the way in. But again, you've got these open terminals that you can quite easily push a piece of metal into, and cause again either serious injury or indeed death, with a high likelihood of death as well. Let's have a look at what fuse is actually in it. And there's extremely small writing on there. I'll look it up under a microscope in a moment, and I'll put it in as a comment on the screen for you when I find out exactly what it is. 
So again, this one, even with the official looking writing, is not safe whatsoever. It's still extremely dangerous. Not sure if I'll be able to get this one apart because it has some strange safety screws, triangular shape, and I haven't got a screwdriver to fit these. So I don't think I'll be able to take this apart. So what I'll do is I'll just leave it as it is without the fuse in and dump it into the bin. So if you're going to buy something from eBay, from Amazon, and it comes with either of those adapters, throw them away straight away. Get yourself one of these, an official UK adapter. Have a look at where the pins go in. Make sure the flaps are there so that there is no chance whatsoever that you could have a risk of electrocution. It's got the fuse in there, of course, and this fuse will probably be a 5 amp. It's actually a 1 amp, which is fine for any load that you might wish to put on it. Usually used for lamps and small appliances, so nothing wrong there. You can get a version of this whereby the actual socket goes inside the plug and the plug clamps down on top of it as well. So there you go, the Chinese and Japanese two-pin adapters. Thank you for watching, and please be safe.